screaming and yelling and heated discussions today at a special board meeting called by the Johnston County Board of Education. That meeting was to release findings from the board's attorney and investigators after a teacher sent a grievance to the board regarding new school board member Michelle Antoine. WRO's Chelsea Donovan is outside the Johnson County Board of Education with details on this. Chelsea. Yeah, as you mentioned, Michelle Antoine is actually a newly elected school board member. She was recently elected in November and about two weeks ago on September 12th, she actually filed a lawsuit suing the Johnston County Board of Education and the chair as well. The state superior judge, though, sealed that document, that lawsuit. So we really didn't know anything about what was in it, except for today. A little bit of that was revealed. Now, as you mentioned, the board's attorney and investigators discussed a grievance someone made in May against school board member Antoine. One of the allegations states that there was inappropriate collaboration between Antoine, another school member, board member not named, and a teacher in the filing of several false grievances. Now, one of those three allegation filed by the attorney found filed by the attorney and investigators found that Antoine was not fully truthful in this investigation and she made inappropriate and disparaging comments about a teacher also not named today's meeting as you mentioned lasted less than an hour and was heated all the way through take a listen informed person, the most disrespected person, the most unprofessional person I've ever seen sit on on, on the board of education or any board don't interrupt me right now now, I, I'm telling hey, you, I'm hey. telling you that right now. What are, what are you going to do? Wait, 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 wait. Just sit down. Look. What? What? As you can see there, they quick. As you can see there, they quickly took a break as the discussions got heated. Now, in this meeting, the school board member, Michelle Antoine, asked if she could respond to these findings by the investigator and the board's attorney. It was decided by a vote of five to two that she could answer the report findings, but it had to be in affidavit form. Now, we're still sifting through this report, and we'll have much more online and beginning in our later evening newscasts. There's a lot there with those fireworks, certainly, Chelsea. We appreciate you staying on top of that. Thanks.